Uh, my name is Dennis Mahoney and today's Ninja Lab experiment is number 320 or the bullet train. What we're going to do is have you look at an idea about punching. And right now from your perspective looking into the screen, I'm looking right into the camera and we're going to have my hands up and we're going to work on punching. So from your perspective, there's a direct line to my chin. My hands are up and when I move my hand, you can see it jump onto the line and go down the line and punch which is absolutely fine. A lot of people can do that. Okay? We're going to test that. That's going to be one test. But then I'm going to think bullet train. All right? If this is the track from me to you, and I do this, the back of the train here, my elbow, isn't on the track. So what we're going to do is we're going to put it on the track. We're just going to bring the elbow in and let it get on the track first and see how it works. That's our idea for today. We'll show you what the pad is going to look like. Alright, so to continue, so I've got this here just so you can see. One of my students got me this, you have them so happy. Alright, so here's our line, you can obviously see it, my hand is here, the hand is passing. See the hand is moving down the line. And there's nothing wrong with that, whether you're boxing or using Tai Jitsu from the Toshin Do and Ninja Jitsu Arts. You got, boom, it's not a bad punch. But what we want you to try today is one, have your hand travel down the line, and the second, have your elbow travel down the line and see what effects you get. So again, here's the difference. One, my hand is traveling down the line. Two, I'm turning my body so my elbow travels down the line. Those are the two we're going to try. Alright, so again, here we go. Ready? Pads here. Remember the line? I can see it in my head. Okay? I'm going to move my hand down the line. However you punch. If you're a boxer, bam, you punch that way. If you use Tai Jitsu, your feet are moving, you're punching down that line. It's a good punch, but the hand's moving down the line. What I want to try now is, here's one, there's the hand. There's the hand. Good strikes. I'm going to try to take, instead of leading the hand down the line, have the elbow pull onto the track and it move down the line. Come on back. So, here, elbow on the line. Elbow on the line. So. It's that simple. These are your two points. You find your target, travel with the hand down the line. A good punch. Then have the elbow deliver the punch down the line and see what you get. See which is more effective for you. See which has more speed, which is more visible. You know, we're hitting a pad right now. Try it with your training partner. Do they see one coming better than the other one? Do they not see one coming? Hey, don't take our word for it like we're always saying. You tell us what results you get. You try it on a pad, you try it on a target, then you try it with your training partners. Which one works better for you? Does one have more speed and delivery? Does one have more power when it hits? Let us know. It's experiment number 320, it's bullet train. Tell us what you think, fill it all in. Remember this is going to turn into a link because this comes from a course called Sci Tai Tech Striking over at NinjaSelfDefense.com. If you like this and you want to check out more, that's where you can find it. We'll see you in the next experiment. Hey, if you're not already a member of NinjaSelfDefense.com, you can try your first lesson, the five Ds of self-defense, absolutely free. Just click the link when you get to the site, or using your cell phone, text NINJA5D, that's N-I-N-J-A-5-D, to the numbers 44222, and uh, we look forward to training with you.